Hey YouTube, so we are here to do the baby planning tag. We got these questions from um, Mimi, which is Ducky FLHDC here on um, YouTube. And so we're just going to go through the questions and I'll answer some. And then if Krista wants to chime in, she will. We all know she's not a talker. So, <laughs> so the first question is, will you find out the gender? Yes. Yes. We're going to find out the gender. We initially didn't want to, but once we actually got pregnant, we we're like, yes, we're going to find out. So next week, I think we'll be able to do the cabbage test, the midwives. I mean, not the midwives, the old wives tale to see if it's a boy or a girl at seven weeks. So, but we do want to find out officially using an ultrasound when it's time. Um, will you use a binky? No. No. Not at all. No. I don't want a two-year-old that has to like pull the binky out of their mouth to have a conversation with you and then put it back in. That's one of my biggest pet peeves. No. Um, do you have any nursery ideas? Yes, kind of. I was waiting until we had our viability ultrasound to really start thinking about the nursery, but I really like Japanese cherry blossom trees, and I really want to have something that's like a gender neutral um, nursery. Do you have any ideas? No. No. It's in the works. Um, are we the first, middle, or last of our friends to TTC? I'd say probably like the first. Maybe? No, maybe like the middle. I don't think our friends were TTCing. <laughs> I think that they just got pregnant. I don't think they were trying. So we're probably the first to actually like plan to get pregnant. But as far as having children, I think we're in the middle. I have a lot of friends though that aren't pregnant and aren't planning to get pregnant. I'm the last. Oh, you're the last? Oh, okay. <laughs> um... Will you get hand-me-downs or use clothes? Yeah, I guess. Krista's probably no. Our baby would probably have to be in all brand new stuff, according to her. But I like to be frugal. And as long as it's not, like, ridiculously stained, then I'm fine with it being used or hand-me-downs. Um, will you, oh, wait. How close in age do you want your children to be? I don't, know. I don't know. We don't know. We I talked about in a video before that we were talking about getting pregnant at the same time. And that is officially out of the window right now. Um, we want to just focus on this one pregnancy. And then once we kind of get our head around this one, then we'll decide. And we're working now to figure out spacing. So, um, Will you make your own baby food? Yes, of course. Uh, we eat organic. Uh, other than these first couple weeks, though, while I've been pregnant, I've been doing really bad. I've been eating fast food and all kinds of other awful things I shouldn't eat. But we will go back eventually to eating organic, and our baby will eat organic and ensure that they don't have any preservatives or other bad things, and I will make baby food from scratch at home. Um, will you co-sleep? Yes. Yep, our baby will be in the bed with us. We will have a family bed. I don't know how that's going to work when there's more kids, but for right now, yes. We will still have a nursery, but the baby will be in the bed with us. It's easier for breastfeeding and other stuff. Um, will you use a stroller? I guess so. I don't know. That's a weird question. I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um... Will you go back to work or stay at home? Um, Krista, are you going to go back to work? Yeah. <laughs> Where am I going? You're not going to work. I'm not going to work. I'm going to be a stay-at-home mom. I'm going to raise our kids at home. <laughs> um, how long will you leave your baby to cry before getting them? For a while. Krista believes in self-soothing. I don't know. It all depends. I'll probably be that weak mom that just like, oh, the baby's crying. And you're going to pick it up, but I don't know. Um, how often will you bathe your child? Uh, every day? They need a bath every day, don't they? 
No, I'm kidding. That's not a joke. Um, I know for the first couple weeks they can't be bathed. They're only supposed to be bathed every other day. Layla, seriously, go. Um, every other day, I think, when they're newborns. And then, of course, every day, a sponge bath, something. They're, we're clean people. So will our baby. I don't like babies that have that milk smell around their neck. Oh, it's gross. I love to smell baby when I nuzzle a baby's neck, not milk or other sour. I know. Oh, it's the worst thing ever. It annoys me. Um, how Will you use an extended rear-facing car seat? Yes. I don't really think that the baby needs to be turned around earlier. I don't really think that they're looking that much out of the window and a rear-facing car seat can see out of the window. Um, I just don't feel like there's any reason to like turn the baby around as soon as they reach that certain point. And if it's safer for them to be rear-facing, I'd rather for them to stay in the rear-facing car seat. Um, will you breastfeed? If so, for how long? Yes, breastfeed. Uh, and breastfeeding until they self-wean or until I start getting bitten way too much. Um, do you want a boy or a girl and do you have a name picked out? I want a girl, but I can't find a name. <laughs> I have a whole super long list of names for girls and boys, but we haven't really come to a consensus on names. Mm -hmm. And I'm fine with either way, either one. I would prefer a girl. Because boys are really rough and tough, but either one, as long as they're healthy, I'm perfectly fine with. Um, how many kids do we want? I only want one, but I'm willing to sacrifice and make two. Two is our number. That's the number, is two. <laughs> um, this is the same question. Okay. Will you homeschool? Yes. Um, I'm. We're in debate on for how long that will be. Um, Krista believes in socialization, and I believe in socialization with the right types of children. So if we can find a really good Montessori school, or here in Seattle there's a lot of language immersion schools, like um, Spanish schools that the kids can go to, or Japanese schools, so that they can learn something else, then I'm fine with that after a certain age, but I definitely will homeschool for the first couple years. So yeah. Um, hospital or home birth? Home birth. Home birth, yep. We don't like hospitals. No, we don't like scal scalpel happy doctors. So we'll be doing a home birth with our fabulous midwife. Uh, will you drink while pregnant? No. No, of course not. Ridiculous. What kind of question is that? No. Um, will you use cloth diapers, nappies, or disposables? No to disposables. And yes, of course, the cloth diapering. And I don't know about nappies. I haven't decided about those. But definitely for cloth diapers, we already have three cloth diapers, and I'm sure that lots more will be joining that stash soon. So definitely cloth diapering disposables put way too much waste in the landfills. And you're not supposed to put human waste in the landfills, people. <laughs> so anyway, that's my cloth diapering spill. But anyway, those are all the questions. Those are fun, huh, honey? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Alrighty, that's it. Thanks. Bye. Bye.